Before the video start please drop a like and subscribe, to help the channel grow and to reach our 1000 subscriber goal. Hey, I have an announcement to make on the podcast, exclusively here on the Views Podcast. I'm officially putting my house up for sale. What? Exclusive. Exclusive. Wow. Do we have the exclusive bell? Oh, here it is. Exclusive with the Views Podcast. Podcast, you're going to get the inside scoop with David and Goop. Goop. <laughs> Damn, why was that so long? What the <laughs> fuck was that? Okay, anyway, yeah, I'm, I'm putting the house up for sale. And the way I figured it about I haven't found a new house, but the way I've thought about it is once this house sells, yeah. I'll just be forced to move somewhere else. I'll we'll be on the street. I'll, be, I'll yeah. be somewhere. I don't care if it's a motel or a hotel. There needs to be a safer place <clears throat> than continuing to live here because people are coming to the door and it's getting so bad. And the worst is like today we were driving up and there were these kids in the car, like three different cars full of kids. Right. And um, and I pull up and like they all look at me. They're all so happy. They're like Dave, and I'm like, I'm never like mean because it's just you know. No, you're so nice. Right. So there's no point. But 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 they can just see how disappointed I am in my face, <laughs> and like they go from like Dave, I'm sorry, man. Listen, we're from Oregon. Just one picture, and everyone goes quiet in the car. Like everybody's like. Ah! Like right before, and then we pull up, and then they're like, uh, and then only one person talks, like the guy who was like, who you know they decided before was gonna talk in case they got into that situation, <laughs> right? And then you know it's usually the dad, and the dad's like, listen, I'm sorry, no, we're not supposed to be here. <laughs> Kids want a picture. It's so it's so Chili's awkward. Is closed. So yeah, I'm putting this up for sale. Do you want it? Uh, I would love it. Okay, let's work something out. <laughs> like what? Mm, I don't know. I take I, your percentage of the views podcast for the next. <laughs> 50 years <laughs> it probably yeah it's a good investment maybe i why do you keep offering it to me i don't know i feel like you need a home <laughs> <laughs> i i've seen your home and i hate it so much Jason. <laughs> i will i'm That's willing so to give you this one for free <laughs> just please move out of there your poor kids your kid's eight feet tall and he lives in a little shack <laughs> your kid is huge and that doorway that he has to run through is fucking so tiny <laughs> their kids are stupid they don't get it they don't understand how Please don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on the bell notification to get notified about new posts and to help the channel grow. They're how stupid. Crappy it is. Do you know you know how they're not stupid but they're like You, you said know, it. You know when you're a kid Jesus <laughs> kids are stupid. I'm, this is the title of the podcast. That's fine. Is it? <laughs> yeah, sure. All right. Jason's kids are stupid. Can I change the word to idiots? <laughs> Jason's kids are. That's fine. People will read it and think it's you saying it. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. Let it be known that Jason said it first. Jason kids are stupid. <laughs> it's not. I'm gonna. You know what I'm gonna do in the in the title? I'm gonna go Jason's and then in parentheses my kids are stupid. <laughs> my kids are stupid. It's not that they're stupid. It's just like you know when you're a kid you don't really know the difference. Like no, I, I grew up in totally. a one bedroom. I'm apartment. kidding. Your house is cool, bro. Yeah, I grew up in a one bedroom apartment and like my mom was like, oh yeah, you have like and uh, I loved it. Your kids, yeah. I, I, I shared a room with. Well, I didn't share a room, but my siblings shared shared a room with three, like three yeah. siblings in one room. Yeah. A bunk bed and then another room, and then they had two guinea pigs in the same room. <laughs> yeah. No. I, trust me, your kids have like your kids have like the craziest living situation ever. I'm just trying to bust your balls and trying to sell this place quick. <laughs> <laughs> How much? Three million. Whoa. Yeah. Would you get it appraised? No, I appraised it myself. <laughs> <laughs> I said this means a lot to me. I need three million. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great time to put a house on the market <laughs> <laughs> you know what i thought about because i'm selling sell the house right? right so i thought who would buy it like just for the price i want no negotiating just whatever mm -hmm. for i'm selling it for three million dollars i thought if anybody's gonna buy it mr beast should buy it <laughs> yeah because when you buy a three million dollar house you only put you're only putting down like the down payment money so 25%. you're not actually putting yeah you're putting 25 percent down mm. um and i think he can you know it'll be a nice piece of real estate and it'll make a one good video <laughs> and i feel like he already spends 10 million dollars a video so why the fuck not um so mr beast if you're listening to this you have full-blown permission to come to my house at any moment without telling me with lawyers and whatever you need and take over the rights to my house. So just come and if you want to buy my house, it's all fucking yours, 100%. Just show up to my door and don't tell me when you're coming so you get my reaction. Okay, see you soon.